Jesse, thank you. Today is Giving Tuesday and Fox 59 is hoping everyone is in the giving spirit. We're in the middle of our Pack the Pantries donation drive. Yeah, local food banks say they're helping more people, which means they need more support. And we got more support as well. We brought in our Angela Goodnote from the morning show to help us out. And we know you guys kicked off the drive this morning and had a very successful drive, might I add. We did. We had so much fun. We did. We had so much fun collecting all the money this morning, doing some challenges. The more people gave, we sang. I did a Purdue cheer, gym dance with the pacemates. We even put Daniel in a dunk tank. It's all to raise money, like you said, for a very good cause. Gleaners and Midwest Food Banks. In our first update since this morning, we've now raised more than $50,000. Your donations support the work they do in our community. To show you inside the operation right now, we're going to send it over to Fox 59's Eric Graves at Midwest. And Eric, what do you have for us in there? Angela, good note here in the afternoon. How lucky are we? We are inside one of the Midwest Food Bank's large warehouses here. I mean, surrounded by thousands and thousands of pounds of food that are going to go all across central Indiana and beyond, all across the state to help out so many people here with Marcy Lujigo, the executive director. Marcy, where are we right now and what kind of uh, does this serve as this big garage door here behind us? Yeah, so we are at one of our locations, and this one actually serves a lot of our smaller pantry partners from across the entire state. So we have 389 pantry partners, and many of them are neighbors serving their neighbors, literally. So it could be a small church in southern Indiana, an overnight shelter, or a special detox program where people go and like live on a farm. And it's really not too complicated. They just come in here, and you guys load them up with whatever products they might need. Uh, what kind of food food things are they getting when they come here? Yeah, so they will have their pick of a variety of options. We start with drinks and dry goods, and sometimes we have things like toys or we have things like diapers, and then they go through and they're able to select eggs, dairy, frozen things, fresh produce. So whatever has been donated to us, then we freely give to the agencies. Absolutely, and your dollar goes a long way. We are going to be telling you more about that coming up at 4.30 and throughout our newscast today. Marcy, stick around. I'm going to need a lot more of your information going forward. We will see you back here in a little bit, though. Eric, we have a dunk tank for you. It's out back there, just so you know. No, you don't. You <laughs> don't do. have a dunk tank for we me. We do. We nope. snug it over there. No, you don't, Angela. He was out, mm -hmm. outside this mm -mm. morning with us, <laughs> so we do have more challenges, though, planned for tonight, starting with you, Nick McGill. If we raise $1,000 by the end of this hour, we hear, Nick, you're super excited about reading our next donation call out in the style uh, of your what? favorite musician. Who agreed oh, to that? Taylor Swift. <laughs> I was not told that that was part of the deal. I heard that that was the truth. So I said, hey, maybe somebody could write something out. So if you're at home watching right now and you want to see that as much as I do, get the donations in. Text the numbers on your screen to get a link to the donation uh, to donate where you do that or go to fox59.com. We have it all right there for you. Again, fox59 slash pack the pantries. I don't remember. Are we still friends? Uh, to any of that? Are we still friends? Uh, we, we are. <laughs> I may have a talk or two with the bosses later, but we're still friends. Nikki I don't the remember. Swifty. I just say, hey, oh, come on. <laughs> okay, I'll do it for the kids. You know, I'll do anything for the Nick loves the kids. Come on.